What's up? How are you guys today? We're doing something a little different because I get way too many emails asking me where I can get certain products and just people placing orders for one or two things when they can easily get them on the foods website, frankiesfoods.com. And real quick before we get started, the whey protein is still available on organsupplements.com and the cod liver oil is also on this website under the vitamin section if you guys have been looking for it. So we got a lot of new products and just a lot of things to go over on the foods website in general. Uh, some of you guys saw we got the beef fat potato chips in stock. We're also going to have the coconut oil. These are the only healthy potato chips online. Most are not made with organic potatoes and especially not high quality saturated fat based uh, frying methods. So you're also supporting local Amish farmers when you buy this. He's, char he's charging me. I'm barely making any money on these chips, but it's nice to have them. It's nice to offer them on the website. Uh, we got a fresh batch of the organic cookie bars in. You guys know the meat granola. And this is a new product. We have an organic chocolate, which is just, you know, minimal ingredients, chocolate, vanilla, sugar, all organic, all high quality stuff. And there's also uh, an almond version with little salt, little almonds. If you guys want to try that out. Uh, a few other new things we have are some epic meat products. I don't know when we're getting the jerky in, and this was just a little substitute until we get our own beef jerky back in stock and available. There's a lot of different uh, products here. We have like a beef bar, a Wagyu steak shit bar, a venison and beef bar, a venison, be uh, no, actually a venison beef strip, a venison beef bar, and then some jerky bites. So there's about five different products under that section. Uh, I always eat apples with every meal and on the go. Sometimes it's difficult for me to find stuff. So we do have some organic dried apples and dried pineapples. This is just the fruit. There's nothing else in these besides organic apple or organic pineapple. And it's really for on the go. You know, it's not something I would have unless I was traveling. And then we have organic pancake and waffle mix. I've been having this mix with the oat flour, which I'll show you guys later, but it's basically just a high quality pancake mix that tastes pretty good. That's minimally inflammatory. And to go with that, uh, we just have some maple syrup, just high quality, organic, single ingredient maple syrup. We are mostly sold out of eggs. I think we just have a small amount of quail eggs left, but this video is being posted on Thursday. We will have some eggs back in stock Friday, tomorrow for you guys. So keep an eye on the foods website. We will be restocking them on here because it's ordered in lower amounts of three dozen quantities. Um, so the eggs will not be restocked on the meat website. Just keep an eye on frankiestrangefoods.com tomorrow. If you want some eggs, we'll have a small amount of chicken, duck, and uh, quail eggs back. So now since we have a lot of products, you know, we broke this down into sections. We have six sections here. Uh, down at the bottom is the Le Moulin Maju products, which are all artisanal, very high quality organic. You know, some of the best honey I've ever tasted. The artichokes that I have daily, either the whole hearts or the spread. I, I like putting them in my white bean puree and other recipes. You have a fig jam. We have some mountain capers. If you want to just do like a spadini, like bread and mozzarella recipe or like uh, some beef tartare and then a malt vinegar which is good for fried foods but these are all very high quality special artisanal products that are really you know very exceptional and can even be used as gifts uh, so we'll go through each of these sections kind of quick you know I'm not going to go too much into detail I'm just showing you guys you know what we have here that's not on the meat website and some stuff that I have in my diet so you guys know I really like the biltong. It's very tasty. It's very delicious. It's very moist. Uh, the beef sticks are also very tasty too. So these products are either super healthy or I just really enjoy the taste. Uh, we showed you guys the epic beef products. I do like the biltong a lot more, but you know people have their preferences. We have the pemmican available still. We're going to have a new pemmican very soon, probably next week. Just plain pemmican. I know you guys have been asking. We're just going to do beef fat and salt. No honey, no blueberries, and I think I think you guys are really gonna like the new the new meat we have in that. Uh, we have the meat granola, which is just dried meat with macadamia nuts, so a little bit of honey. Blue. This is really good for people who don't like meat because it does not taste like meat at all. I swear to you, it tastes like a granola, and the texture is delicious. So that that's the main purpose of that. It's like if you need protein in your diet, but you don't like eating meat first thing in the morning, that's that's a pretty good use for that. The nutritional bars, which is is honestly my favorite part of this website because 
you can't find protein or energy or, you know, like fruit and nut bars anywhere near this quality. They just don't exist online. You know, with the cookie bars, we're using coconut oil, saturated fat, coconut milk, high quality organic flour, organic chocolate, everything in this. Uh, actually, you know, what? I don't I don't think that we're really using the coconut oil anymore. It's just hazelnut and walnut ground up into there. So it's just so, so high quality, all organic ingredients. Same thing with the chocolate chip granola bar. You know, if you go to buy one from the store, even the highest quality organic brands, they're using like brown rice protein, brown rice syrup, so high in arsenic, pea protein, all types of stuff you don't want to be putting in your body. These are the highest quality bars available online. So that's our granola bar. The first one was our cookie. And then this third one is our take on like a fruit and nut bar using banana. So it's not really that similar to the granola bar, but it kind of is. And then we have our classic best bar, which is like a cake, like soft texture, really dense protein, B fat bar. Uh, these other bars don't really have that much protein. The pemmican does, but if you're looking for high protein, the best bar and uh, the pemmican are the main two. So now we're going to go to the water kefir and coconut water section, which also has the sugars and stuff. So you guys know I, I have water kefir and water kefir grains basically with every meal. Probiotics are so important. And this is like the only live active non-dairy based probiotic you can even find online. You know, we have some dairy stuff on the meat website. But this is really it outside of that. You can't find everything in the grocery store is dead culture. It's just not good. You have some coconut water, which I like. It's potassium, really tasty. And then we have the ingredients to make the water kefir, molasses and raw cane sugar. And I mean, yeah, you could use cane sugar for a lot of recipes, but maple syrup that I use for the pancakes. Now the water kefir doesn't exist anywhere else online. You can't buy it. You have to, you'd have to make it yourself, but our price on the water kefir grains per ounce is also the best online. And usually other people package it in uh, in plastic as opposed to glass. I think we are running out though. So now this is the main section I wanted to show you guys because a lot of people will order like one or two beef tallow or they'll like order 10 from the meat website. But you know, to avoid the shipping requirement on the meat website, you guys can just come to frankiestrangefoods.com and you can buy all of the animal-based fats on here. And we also have a few new things. Uh, we do have ghee, clarified butter. <laughs> I always laugh because uh, some years ago when I was bartending at a bar, I, I was like, it was around when I was like on the carnivore diet for a year or two. Like I didn't start YouTube at the time. And I was talking about ghee to these guys at the bar and they thought it sounded like gay. So they, they were, they were kind of making fun of me while I, while I was like seriously trying to explain what ghee was, cause you know, it's a weird word, but anyway, that's, that's my story on clarified butter, which is, is nice for cooking. You know, if you're going to use, if you want to use butter for cooking, this is what you should actually be using because it doesn't have the milk proteins that'll burn. And then you would add like the raw butter we have on Frankie strange meat at the end for that milky butter flavor. Then we just have a macadamia nut butter, which I like. Macadamia nuts are just the healthiest fat in general because of their saturated and monounsaturated fat profile. Pecan butter, which I, I just like the idea of because usually when you have like walnut or hazelnut butters, they, they always mix them with a bunch of other nuts. So to see a pure pecan butter to me was a special product and it'd be nice on its own with fruit or in baking recipes. Of course, we have macadamia nuts to match. Roasted and salted, guys. These are absolutely delicious. It, it, trying to lose weight or try not to spend too much money. Don't buy them because you will eat the whole bag in one sitting. Brazil nuts, good source of minerals. That's mainly, I mean, this whole bag would probably last you months, you know. Have one or, have one or two Brazil nuts a day, that's it. Uh, this is the chocolate we showed you guys earlier at the top of the website. And then here under coconut oil, we have just the regular solid coconut oil, which I use when I'm not. Uh, lazy, but most of the time I'm lazy. So I just like using the liquid and uh, just pouring it in the pan real quick. Uh, the only downside of the liquid is it is MCT oil. So it's not something you want to cook for, for like a really long time, but that's when you would use the solid. So we have both solid, which is also a little more affordable and liquid coconut oil. Now under the grains and beans are the foods that I've started incorporating into my diet to kind of like detox my liver and uh, just have variety. You know, it's basically 
the only healthy grains that I find are acceptable to eat. You know, so this is a, a wheat based udon noodle. That is the only pasta I've been able to tolerate. So if you guys are looking for a pasta that doesn't give you issues, this is it. I've been eating these noodles every single night for like a, over a year now, I think over a year now. And they come in a single package or package of eight. And then we have a variety of oats. So I'm usually too lazy to do the steel cut oats overnight. So normally if I want oatmeal, I'll have these in the morning. Uh, do they take maybe, you know, five or 10 minutes after you boil the water just to soak it up? And then I also have oat flour, uh, which I'm experimenting with mixing 50, 50 with the pancake mix just to add more fiber because the pancake mix is uh, white flour and you do want to, uh, either mix it with half quick oats or half oat flour. I'm just trying to see if like the, the quick oats are better than the oat flour. We'll probably do a recipe this weekend on that for you guys. Then we just have a bunch of organic flours. So we have bread flour, which this is the one I currently use to make my sourdough every other day. Then we have all purpose flour, which is usually I use for baking and cookies. And then we have the pastry flour, uh, which I like for frying meats and stuff like breading meat, because the whole wheat has like a lot of flavor when you fry it. So I like breading cod with this and then like searing it in the pan. Uh, that's the main thing I've been using that flour for just some barley here. This is the barley we do use in our barley stew. If you guys have been trying that on the meat website, white rice. I've actually been eating rice for lunch the past few days. If I don't have time to make sourdough, you know, I just put some rice in the rice cooker in the morning and then time it for lunch. So when I come home, I have some carbs to eat. This is our sourdough starter that only sourdough starter online. I've seen made with glass bottled mineral water and organic flour packaged in glass. However, after I do things, other people tend to copy them. So I'm sure you can go on Etsy and buy it from some corporate shill pretending to be a small business. Organic quinoa. I mean, it's it's lower in arsenic than rice. Um, I actually like the quinoa. It's, it's pretty tasty if you put a little bit of oil and salt on it. And I, I haven't had it in a while, but I do have it on occasion. So if you don't respond good to white rice, the main reason you would want to do quinoa is is especially before bed because... It is the whole grain. It is fibrous, which is necessary for detoxing the liver. But if you're just going to have white rice, you probably want to have beans with it is a good idea. So the nice thing about the quinoa is you can just throw the quinoa in the rice cooker and have it on its own. Whereas the rice, you're also going to have to make beans on the side unless, you know, you buy our jovial cannellini beans that are already prepped. And for me, this is great on the go. If I don't have time or forgot to make beans, otherwise... I will, you know, make my own beans. We have a 25 pound bulk bag of dried beans on here. That's what I normally have every day. But in a pinch, if I forget to make something, we do have the canned beans. And that's our pancake and waffle mix again down here in the grain section. So these are all the carbs that comprise most of my diet. Uh, basically, I've been eating udon noodles, bread flour and oats every day, uh, Beans in the white bean puree, I puree them up. You guys have seen that recipe a few times on occasion. And lately I've been having the pancake and waffle mix. And then the other stuff here and there uh, I do have on occasion. So just quick salt and seasoning section. The steak seasoning, I like putting on potatoes and I'll mix into different recipes here and there. We have our rose salt and our sea salt. If you're doing a big piece of meat on the grill, I like using the rose salt. Otherwise for pretty much all cooking and, and most other purposes, I like the pure ocean sea salt. Nice fine grain not too powdery and it's not too large either. And then we have our, you know, our coconut amino soy sauce substitutes. Most of you guys know that we do use that in a lot of recipes. So that's the overview of the foods website for you guys. And I probably should have said this at the beginning, but you know, Hey, you know, we're not Amazon. We're not Costco. You know, a lot of these big corporate owned businesses, uh, that most people shop at. So, you know, give us, give us like a day or two to, to ship your package out. And uh, hey, look, if you want to keep supporting those big guys, eventually you'll be getting uh, anal swabbed on your way into the store. So, you know, be, be, you know keep, keep, be mindful, be mindful. And hey, when you spend money there, you know, you're buying uh, like 0.001% uh, of some scumbags yacht. Uh, in my case, you're just the money's going back right into the business and you guys are getting new and exciting products every week. But thank you guys for joining me today. FrankieStrangeFoods.com. Uh, look, if you guys continue to support us, I will continue to just keep providing you guys with new and high quality health food products. 
hopefully in the next two or three years we can keep doing a lot of stuff and uh uh, I really do look forward to expanding everything and and getting you guys not only the highest quality stuff but the most affordable products that you that you know the average person can incorporate every day. So this is all the new stuff for the most part that we're going to have for a little while on the foods website, but definitely keep an eye on the organ supplements and Wi-Fi shielding and stuff over the next uh, few weeks for some new stuff as well. Hope you guys are enjoying the end of your week, and uh, I'll see you guys soon. Thank you.